Welcome to the Man in the Middle. I am your host, Bill West. Today we're going to be doing a, uh, an extended version of a Hero Fight episode. we got uh, quite a bit to go through. I haven't uh, done an episode of theirs. I haven't done much lately because I don't... I have a Doctor Who episode I need to do and I just don't want to do it. And so I've been putting a bunch of stuff on the back burner. But, uh, you know, maybe if we get far enough away we can just ignore it. <laughs> All right, this is the first one. I've got uh, three envelopes from Hero 5 to open. I'm trying not to dox myself. Ah, oh, the little pitter pad of dogs in the background. We've got the uh, door open, so if you hear little pitter pats, uh, that's probably what you're hearing is my dog, or dogs. They're wondering what I am doing in here all by myself. They never get to come in because I usually have the door closed. You know, I always complain about people who don't score their boxes so they can open them easily, and I never do it. <laughs> I guess that makes me a little bit of a hypocrite, doesn't it? Okay, so the first one... Oh... I didn't realize I bought two of these. <laughs> so, the first one is the TIE Interceptor from Return of the Jedi. I absolutely love the Starfighter. It's one of the... Uh, Greatest things about Return of the Jedi was the introduction of the tie-in. Let's get it out of here. Also, on the back of it, I thought I had purchased it, but it never came in. I didn't think about checking. I'd ordered that for my daughter for Christmas. I ended up ordering two because I didn't think, I couldn't remember ordering this one. Okay. Watch out, Interceptor's coming in. This is 6 of 40. This is, of course. A harsh proof. I mean, coming in over the Star Destroyer. I absolutely love that ship. And it's a little card here. Thanks, Bill. So happy you like my. I like. So happy you like my new tie interceptor artwork. Enjoy. And so. Yeah, that's. That's very cool. My dog is like, what are you talking about? I'm a little hoarse if you didn't figure it out. Uh, I've been dealing with... Uh, I've been down with the sickness lately. <laughs> I'm sorry, it's a bad joke, but I had to do it. As always, or not always, but as with most of my stuff from uh, Hero Pied, this is Star Wars again. Thanks, Bill. Happy New Year. Episode 6. This was the first one in the uh, original trilogy numeric. Star Wars Return of the Jedi, 11 of 40. The Force is strong in my family. It's got what? Uh, A Wing. A Wing versus a tie in. It's got some indoor stuff on the bottom. It's got the Death Star on top. Really, really nice coloring. Very green. <laughs> I guess I should have opened this one last because it's going to ruin the other two. Uh, 
if you haven't checked out Rob's artwork, you can find him on uh, eBay and, or not eBay, Etsy and Facebook under Herofied. If you don't like Star Wars, you don't want to collect Star Wars, he has uh, Superman, Marvel Comics, DC. Uh, he has his own, which I absolutely love, called uh, Rocketing Past. Uh, that one speaks to me because of a lot of stuff that a lot of the topics he does for Rocketing Past uh, is like things out of my own past. And I really appreciate, you know, the memories he's had. Like, you know, the, the monkey bar is shaped on a rocket. He's got, uh, you know, a re uh, record player in one. He's got... Uh, uh, I can't remember the name of the RV that was popular in the 70s, late 70s, early 80s. Uh, diners that look like, uh, you know, the old silver diners that look like mobile homes. You know, it's just, it's, it's an amazing set. I can't wait for more of those to come out because, like I said, they... Uh, Or part of my past. <laughs> All right, episode four, A New Hope. We got uh, the droids, we got Tatooine, we got the dust, the trench run from Vader's point of view. You know, sabers. That's really nice. This was nine to forty, artist proof, of course, as always. And last but not least is, ooh, that's a really nice blue. You would think Dagobah would have been more green, but yeah. Uh, my ally is the Force, and a powerful ally it is. You got Bespin, you got the uh, raising of the X-Wing from Dagobah, and you have uh, Hoth with the uh, Adats and the Snow Spears. And this one was 12 out of 40. Check them out. I don't think the artist proofs of these will be available anymore. Episode 4. The Force will be with you. Always. Uh, yeah. Uh, if you... You know... Uh, Check out independent creators. Go on Etsy. Go on eBay. Find something you like, uh, and support them. It doesn't have to be Rob. I'm not, I would like it to be Rob. I don't get paid for any of this. I'm I've been a fan of Rob's for about 10, 15 years now. I I don't buy everything he puts out, but I do buy quite a lot, quite a lot, because uh, I like his work. I'm a big Star Wars fan. I don't know if you, you probably can't. See. Right there, it's all, almost all the Star Wars books. And uh, I don't think you can see uh, any of my Star Wars stuff up here or, or anywhere else around the room. But I'm a big Star Wars fan, even with the debacle of the Kathleen Kennedy years. She can't take away what came before. But, so I'm loud and proud Star Wars fan. I always will be. And... Uh, I'm glad that Robert, Rob is a fan, too. Okay, I hope you enjoyed this episode. If you did, please give me a thumbs up, drop a comment down below, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already, and, of course, visit Rob on Facebook and uh, Etsy. That's, uh, that's it for today. I do have some more episodes hopefully coming up. I hope I have time. If not, uh, I'll try to get some done tomorrow. You guys take care, and I'll talk to you again soon.